What it do, you to the two. It's the kid Bone Santoro. Back at you with another one. Hey yo, this is a message to all you fake ass Drake and Kendrick Lamar fans. I'm tired of y'all niggas, man. First of all, I just want to address that Family Matters song by Drake. That's the gayest, zestiest song I ever heard in the history of hip hop and a battle rap. You know what I'm saying? Look, go back and listen to it. Look how zesty that shit sound. You know what I'm saying? And I'm not even a Drake or a Kendrick Lamar fan. Never have been. And I'm getting to the bottom of fucking why I'm not. Because that fucking Family Matters song, bro, you could have kept that shit, bro. Nigga, I need something that's going to make me have, make me watch my back after I get done listening to that shit, looking over my shoulders and shit. You know what I'm saying? That gay-ass Fruity Pebble song yo ass put out there talking talk about so Kendrick Lamar this. And you could have gay. That shit sound like your son wrote that. You know what I'm saying? That shit was trash. Now, Meet the Grams is the better song out of all of them. You know what I'm saying? I had to, you know what I'm saying? When I was playing it, I had to turn on the damn lights. I was sitting in the dark when I was playing it, and that scary ass beat came on. I'm like, oh shit. You know I'm saying? Let me go ahead and turn and use this bright ass light you see right there. I had to turn that shit on. You know what I'm saying? Because I ain't know what was going to come out the woodworks, you know what I'm saying? So, that's the better diss song out of all of it, you know what I'm saying? Now, all you fake-ass Kendrick Lamar fans out there, y'all sitting there talking all that shit. Remember when J. Cole was like, four albums in five years, ten years, nigga, I can divide. Remember when he said that? So, y'all basically trying to say, oh, he don't put out enough music, or he put out music every few years and all this other shit. Now... He puts out one week's worth of music about a month or two ago. And y'all dick riding him, nigga, like he never left the scene before. You know what I'm saying? Niggas is dancing, bunny hopping, Harlem shaking, and crip walking at the same time. You know what I'm saying? You know what I mean? Like, y'all up here trying to say he unified the gangs. And he changed, he, this nigga popped out for one week. And all of a sudden, he's the president of the United States getting the same love. You feel me? You would have thought he was the president. You know what I mean? And y'all was just talking all this shit before he dropped. He dropped one song with Future. Y'all started to all oh, this nigga. He just pops out out the blue. He cloud chasing. Boom. He dropped four more songs. You feel me now? Oh, he's the king of rap. He's the king of hip hop. And all this other shit. You know what I'm saying? Which one is he? he either he is or he not. You know what I'm saying? Dick riding ass. All this excessive cock riding. Now, we gonna get to motherfucking Not Like Us. I ain't like that song since the first time DJ Academics premiered it on his live stream because he kept playing that damn song. It was literally live when I watched it, so it was in real time. So it was everybody's first time hearing that song. And he played the hell out that song for almost three to fucking four hours, giving down breakdowns and shit, and kept rewinding the damn beat. Dun, dun, dun. You know what I'm saying? So... If all of y'all is just now getting hip to that damn song, I heard it the first night Academics premiered it on his live stream. I hated it ever since that one night. You know what I'm saying? I can't even scroll down on social media with the sound on because I'm clicking on this bad bitch picture. And when you click on it, it's... Da, 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 da. You know what I'm saying? Then I scroll down, it's another bad one. You know what I'm saying? Twerking. You click on the video and all you hear is... Da, 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 da. You know what I'm saying? I'm tired of that shit. Tell that nigga Kendrick Lamar to drop another damn song. You know what I'm saying? Like, I'm not a fan of Drake. I'm not a fan of Kendrick. But God damn, y'all playing the hell out that damn song. You know what I'm saying? It's to the point, what else do this nigga got? I want to hear something else. You know what I'm saying? It's the most this nigga ever got played, man. Fuck. You know what I'm saying? That's how I'm knowing y'all niggas is faking. How the fuck you make 30 million views, nigga, in two hours? You know what I'm saying? How much money did that shit cost? You know what I'm saying? I've been doing this shit for years, nigga. It take me three days to get two views. You know what I'm saying? So how the fuck you get 30 million in two hours? So, I'm just saying, man. Tell that nigga Kendrick Lamar to drop a different damn song. And hopefully it get the same traction. It's not like us. Because other than that, y'all niggas is being fake. You know what I mean? And the reason why Drake is looking stressed out right now, you feel me? Because he realizing, like, damn, 